my loves and welcome to the fab live channel you're really welcome here my name is ty brown and i'm really excited to do this video today thank you so much for clicking on this video and joining me today's video as you can see is all about the stylish way of monochromatic dressing or monochromatic outfits and i hope you'll find this video helpful in choosing outfits of one color palette and really how that can elevate your look do you hit the subscribe button if you enjoy it and let me know what your favorite outfit or favorite look was or even your favorite color palette so without further ado we're going to get straight on to today's video today's video of course is all about keeping items in a similar hue even if they are different shades which is often one of my key tips is picking items of similar colors but in different shades to really add interest and dimension to your outfit and i'm going to be talking you through about five or six different outfits of different color palettes that i absolutely love here I've teamed my sleeveless nude trench dress from Dorothy Perkins. It is such a gorgeous dress, really flatters the female form. I love this because it's just another take on that classic other piece, which is the trench coat. But here having it as a sleeveless dress. Now replaying on those pinky nudes, I have got my two ultimate favorite combo, which are my nude Pigalis from Louboutins. Now they on me, of course, are more of a pinky nude and I find they go so, so well with my ASOS nudie pink uh, top handle bag. Now, by all means, if you wanted to add a coat on top of that or you wanted to layer with a top or long sleeve top or bodysuit underneath, again, that would give you that element of warmth. But I do like this outfit as is, especially if you're still working from home or you live in warmer climes than it is in England right now. Very simple and very effective. I love grey so much as a colour, especially when you start to team the different shades of grey. So here I have teamed my grey jeans from Primark with a grey light knit from Zara. This is from the Zara Basic range. It's a scoop neck, so it's very flattering. It allows you to team a little necklace if you would like or just leave it as is. It's got the lovely button detail, so again, just adding a little something to your outfit. And I'm teaming it it with a pair of grey heels, a classic grey oversized coat which I just love casually slung over the shoulders and a grey flat bag. So it is all shades of grey going on here and it is such an elegant look. So this is one of my all time favourite combos. Now you know I cannot do an outfit without adding in one of my favourite colours which is of course Bay. I have gone here for this beautiful Zara pleated midi skirt with the belt detail. Such a beautiful skirt. The way it flows and the way it moves, it's very, very flattering. And that belted detail just helps nip you in the waist. Now I've teamed that here with my Victoria Beckham knit, which is a beige knit, such a beautiful wall knit now this does have a navy blue panel towards the hem and what i'm going to do is just tuck that into the skirt so you're still getting those beige effects without something like the blue really breaking up the color if you did need to throw on a blazer then just throw on a beige blazer over the top just to complete the look and perhaps give you a little bit more warmth as well is the universally the most flattering color the most worn color as with any of the other colors one of my other tips is to look for differences in texture and fabric which can also add to that feeling of having more dimension to your look and not keeping it maybe quite so plain and boring so here i'm teaming a black dress from primark i love this because of the details like the pocket detail which is a different fabric from the dress itself i do like to contrast my volume so if i do have something a bit more voluminous up top then i do want to think about something fitted on the bottom which is why i'm going for something like the over the knee boot you could then throw on over a tweed coat a black tweed coat again that different texture is adding that element of interest to your outfit and a classic flap bag it doesn't get any more classic than this outfit <laughs> 
I love this caramel brown which is actually very on trend for this season I'm loving this particular look and it is this very light knit roll neck knit from Zara so the pair of trousers that I'm teaming them with are also from Zara in fact this is a near full Zara outfit because I'm teaming it then with my gorgeous brown blazer it's in the tuxedo style if that isn't enough and you still need a little bit more layering just chuck on over the top this zara tan wool coat which is in the most beautiful italian wool and this is from next i love these shoes i've had them a couple of years now and the great thing about pairing something like this color that is closer to your own skin tone is it gives that element of elongation of the legs now of course you do not need to keep everything quite so plain so this is tip number Number three is going for a little bit of pattern so here I could easily swap this tan oversized coat uh, here the pattern is got lots of elements of that cream the browns the ecrus and actually even a hint of black in there as well where everything else was looking a little bit plain by having a patterned fabric or patterned item just keeps the look again looking that little bit more interesting but still just as elevated and just as elegant now I talked before and I've talked a few times about loving navy blue as just a chic alternative to black. This navy blue trousers are from Zara. I loved the beige ones so much over the summer that I purchased these for autumn. I probably will tuck the top in so you may lose some of the detail like the scallop on the hem but you can still see that on the sleeve and then we can add a navy bag. I've got the choice here of two gorgeous bags very similar in color very different in style so I guess it depends what you're going for either something that's a little bit more work wear appropriate like my GST it's such a classic it is now discontinued the GST but it goes so well with this all navy outfit a more recent acquisition which is a bag that I unbox on YouTube here with you guys is this beautiful navy bag from Aspinall of London such a gorgeous bag both have that gold hardware so adding to the richness and the warmth of the outfit which really picks up on the gold jewelry that I'm wearing so my loves I hope this video has helped to inspire you or convince you about monochromatic dressing don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already and do come say hi on Instagram because I post quite regularly on Instagram and I'm quite interactive there so come say hello and we can talk all things fashion hair health and beauty thank you so much for joining me today's video and I'll catch you soon take care bye